hi guys welcome back to our channel today i have my son luke with me for the first time on our channel today luke how old are you four four <laughs> so today what are we gonna draw a tractor a tractor let's get started okay so we've each got a pencil and a sharpie and assorted markers i think today we'll just color our tractor with the markers what do you think yeah yeah so first we're going to start with the hmm i don't know <laughs> okay i think we should start with a rectangle do you know how to draw a rectangle there's a couple ways you can draw a rectangle let me show you an example you can draw a rectangle tall and skinny like a building but we don't want to do it that way we want to draw our rectangle like a block that fell over, right? Yeah. Okay, so that's how we're going to start our tractor. So can you make a pretty big rectangle in the middle of your paper? Ooh, <laughs> my pencil broke. <laughs> All right, now you try. Can you do it right here? Mm-hmm. A little bigger if you want. That's it. Nice. That's the engine of our tractor. The next thing we're going to do is draw the big tire. What shape are tires? Circles. Circles. So right here in the corner, it'll be this corner for yours, I'm going to draw a really big circle. Okay, I'll try it. <laughs> and that's the big back wheel of our tractor. Good. Now inside of that wheel, we're going to draw another smaller circle. And now we need a front tire, don't we? So for the front tire, we're going to draw a little circle. Should we draw the steering wheel? Actually, what we're going to do next is uh, we're going to draw a straight line. Uh, we can draw another circle in here. Okay. Now we're going to draw a straight line right above the big tire like this. Mm -hmm. And that's where our farmer's going to sit. Now we need to draw the back seat of his little chair. Mm -hmm. Very nice. That's so good. Now we'll draw the steering column and it's just going to come like a straight line right out of the back side of that rectangle. There's our steering wheel. <laughs> nice. Now most tractors have a smokestack, right? So yeah. on the front and on the top of our rectangle, we're going to draw a little smokestack like that. So somewhere up here, tiny skinny little smokestack. And you can make some smoke coming out of it. All you got to do is draw a little curly cue like that. Good. That is some great looking smoke. Nice job. Okay. The next thing we're going to do is draw a little square inside of our rectangle. And this is going to be the engine on our tractor. And then we'll just draw some straight up and down lines inside of there. <laughs> Good. Do you want to draw a farmer in the tractor? Yeah. Okay. So to start, let's draw his head floating right about here. A little circle for his head. And then you can just draw a straight line through it so it looks like a farmer hat. Good. And then to draw his body, we're just going to start at the bottom of our circle and make a line all the way down on either side of his body. That's great, buddy. Okay. Something I like to do is use a Sharpie to outline our drawing and just make it really pop. Do you want to try that? Yeah. Now remember, Sharpie is permanent, so don't touch it with your fingers, okay? Okay. Okay, so what we're going to do now is just outline our pencil marks with our Sharpie. You can start with your tire. Is there any Sharpie on my hands? I think you're all clean. <laughs> While you're outlining, I'm going to color in my tires. What 
what color are you gonna make your tractor? I'm gonna make it green, just like a green tractor. Yeah, it's like a John Deere tractor. What color are you gonna do? I think I'll make mine red. There. Yes, good job. So then you can color in your tractor, you can add grass, you can add sky if you want to. You can make it any color you want. Look at the beautiful glass. Good job. He's plowing a field, isn't he? Are you all done? Yeah. Great job, buddy. What do you think? Are you happy with it? Yeah. Good. All right. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you're new here so you never miss any new videos. Thanks for watching.